Hello everyone, thanks for watching this video. So in this video, today we are going to understand what is the offset in Apache Kafka. As this is the third video and in last two video we already understood that what is the Kafka in very high level and what is the topic in detail. And this video is basically talking about only the offset value in Apache Kafka. So what is the offset in Apache Kafka? So offset value is nothing but one kinds of unique number, incremental unique number. With the help of this number, we can able to access the message from the topic. So basically, if you see your topic having the many partition and each partition containing some kinds of data and that some kinds of data we are identifying with the some unique number and that unique number is called offset okay so now we need to understand some of the fact of the offset so what are the rule and regulation or what is the fact of offset value in apache kafka first fact is that that your Offset value is only in an integer number. It's neither a string nor a wire car. It's 0, 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, something like that. Okay. This is the first thing that your offset value is only an unique integer number. Second one is that offset value is unique only for respective partition. What do you mean by respective? Unique you understood that it's a non-repeatable. But what do you mean by respective partition? So for that if you see in this diagram you will be having one topic and this topic having total four partition called partition 0, partition 1, 2, 3 and 4 and if you see each partition you will be having some block and that this set of block is nothing but the data. For now you understand this block contains some data as well as this block is also containing some data for all the partition and each block is assigned with the one unique identification number like 0, 1, 2, 3 and that unique identification number with respect to any partition is called offset value. Now coming to the first fact, offset value is an integer number. So if you see 0, 1, 2, 3, 0, 1, 2, 3, 0, 1. 0, 1, 2, 3, 0, 1, 2, these are all are the integer number. This is the first fact. What is the second fact? Offset value is unique, unique only for the respective partition. Meaning that if you are talking about the partition 0, so 0, 1 and 2, 3 will comes only one times. Okay, but if you talk about the partition 1, so 0 will again come, meaning that if 0 came as a offset value in partition 0, it doesn't means that the 0 offset doesn't come into the partition 1, 2, 3, 4. No. The uniqueness of the offset value is only applicable within a partition. So suppose that you have used the your offset value 2 in partition 0. So you can also use the same offset value for partition 1, 2, 3 or 4 if data is available or it required. Okay. So uniqueness of the offset value is applicable within a partition only. Now third thing is that from two different partition having equal offset value can provide you the complete different message. Meaning that as we already understood that this is the block of message or block of data and each block is identified with the offset value. Suppose that in your partition 0, in first place you will be having some data. Partition 0, first place and same partition 1, first place having some data. So it is not necessary that the, your data will be same from in both the partition, meaning that partition 0, partition 1 having same offset number or partition 1 third offset value is equal to partition 4 third offset value. It is not required. So that is the reason we are saying that 
partition 1 offset 5 does not equal to partition 2 offset 5 even though both having same offset value it doesn't mean that you will get the same message okay order of offset value is in, in incremental order it's same only so 0 1 2 3 it's it will increase keep increasing okay now fifth fact of the offset is that order of offset value can be maintained within the same partition not across meaning that if your part is, if you are only talking about the partition 0 and your order is 0 1 2 3 what it means that what we understood that okay zeroth offset value data came before first offset value and second offset value data came before first value so in that way we can understood that so we can understood that okay this this value which is available into the third place having third offset is the latest data of the partition 0 but it doesn't means that the same data will available into the partition 1 also that's why we are saying that order of offset value can be maintained within the same partition. It is also possible that your partition 0 contain 3 offset meaning the 4 data but in your partition 2 contain only 2 data. So we cannot assume that okay which value came prior to which one and which one is the old or which one is the new one. And that we can only assume within a single partition. Here we can guarantee that okay, the data which is available with the third offset value came after second and second came after first and first came after zeroth. That we can guarantee but we have not guaranteed that okay, this third data came after partition zero of first. Okay. So everything happen within a partition only. Now sixth point is that offset value are always increment and never used old offset value. We already understood that this is in incremental order. Now what is the telling is never use old offset value. Meaning that in your partition 0 if you used 0 offset, 1 offset, 2 offset, 3 offset, so for upcoming data you should be using 4, 5, 6 but not 0, 1, 2 and 3. Okay. So once you use this offset value meaning that you are done with that. Even though if you delete the data from here or it, it got deleted after one week by default, you cannot be able to use this data this offset value so this offset value is always new unique but within a partition okay everything we are talking about the within a partition only why because if you see here the offset value is always good and okay seventh is that default max duration of the data of respective offset value is seven days meaning that when you are saving some data into the any of the partition by default it will be alive for 7 days. If you want to keep data for more days for that you need to do some extra configuration but by default it is 7 days. Eighth thing is that data of respective offset cannot be changed meaning that if you have some data into the zeroth assigned with the zero offset so if you trying to modify it becomes the new data which is available into the might be in your offset one but you cannot exactly modifying the data of offset zero as it is the immutable as same as a string okay so in a string if you are doing a string str equal to new string meaning that you are creating actually the new string okay but in the same way the as as soon as you assign the data for the zero offset you never is going to change the data and if you trying to change then probably it will come to the your with with the new offset value okay 
so yeah and the count of offset value may not be equal into the across the partition it is same as offset value is assigned with your data meaning that message and it is not necessary that your all the partition meaning that 0 1 2 3 4 contain equal number of message it is possible that your 0 and 1 are equal number of message but partition 2 have only two message as same as your partition 4 have three message so it is not guaranteed that your all the partition contain equal number of message since message is not equal so offset value is obviously not equal so that is all about the offset value so what we understood is that offset value is the unique identification number of each and every your message or data and the uniqueness is available within a partition only and the data available for the same offset value in different partition will be not equal okay and every rule and regulation is applying within a partition and all the data available into the your topic which is assigned or associated with the offset value is unique and you cannot able to modify the data meaning that your data is immutable so this is all about the offset in apache kafka okay yeah thanks for watching this video